got a new show for y'all. Got a damn good show. Biden administration said it again, man. It's time to pander to the Negroes. Well, of all, okay, there's a lot of stuff that should be banned in this country. But of all the things to ban in this country, the Biden administration wants to ban menthol cigarettes. Well, you should be banning little boys from keeping them from chopping their dicks off, calling them women. Or women getting a, having prepubescent girls like mm-hmm. removing that breast tissue. Yeah, or, or having kids, prepubescent kids. The most vulnerable demographic people in this country to take drugs to prevent them from going into puberty. No, let's do them, let's do them ban that. Let's ban these Negroes <laughs> smoking menthol cigarettes. How can I give the impression that I actually care about these Negroes? <laughs> I know what I do. They fall for it. I'm gonna ban menthols so I can spin it. Man, these are more addictive than regular cigarettes. I'm gonna ban it. This is racism. Yeah. That's what I do. It's diabolical. These Negroes won't see it coming. Hey, hey bring up this uh, website. Um, more addictive and harder to quit. Health group wants black menthol smokers to know support groups can help. <laughs> read the, Like only black people smoke menthols. Man, everybody smoke menthols. Yeah, let me read this real quick. As the Biden administration, hey, white man said, hey, give me a pack of Marlboros. We ain't got no Marlboros. What you got? Newport, so I ain't smoking that shit. <laughs> That's more addictive. <laughs> I might want to quit one day. <laughs> That's how they spit it, right? That's how they spit it. If, if y'all Negroes believe this, you are, man. Well, I already know y'all the dumbest demographical hey, voters out there. Let me, let me read this, Kevin. Let me read this. Look. Uh, as the Biden administration moves closer to abandoning menthol cigarettes and flavored cigars, major health organizations are pushing to get, get the word out to black smokers <laughs> that help is available for those who <laughs> want to quit. Yeah, Negroes <laughs> like sugar in their cigarettes. <laughs> and their cigars, they like sweet stuff. <laughs> Let me read this, Kevin. Um, the vast majority of black smokers in the U.S., 85% use menthols, according to the Campaign for Tobacco-Free Kids. In 2020, Nearly 81% of black smokers used menthols compared to 34% of white smokers. Okay, what does that tell you? There's more white people in this country, so there's more white people smoking menthols than anything. Yeah. Just because 85% of black people smoke menthols, Mm -hmm. more white people in this country smoking menthols. Yeah. See, they're just patterns. They look what I'm going to do for them, I'm going to ban these. They're leaving out the, 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 they're leaving out very important details. They're lying by omission. Yeah. So, why don't you focus on what's important to the black community? Look at this video it, yeah. up in Oakland. That's yeah. impacting black people far more than Newport yeah, yeah. cigarettes. If you actually want to help Negroes, you should be doing this. Yeah. Check this out. Building. Why? Where's the mirror? Y'all, these fucking towns are fucking shit, yo. It's all about fucking money. It's a fucking money grab. Y'all give a fuck about the motherfuckers that was born and fucking raised here. Y'all raised the fucking rent. You so fucking high. Can't afford to live here. But y'all gonna bring some other motherfuckers here? That doesn't fuck that up. It doesn't make no fucking sense. None. None. I'm fucking homeless. I work a full time job, 40 hours. And can't pay to live here. How the f are y'all gonna bring somebody else here? Yeah, that's up in Boston, Massachusetts. There is a community center. Mm-hmm. They're, and they're putting illegals in there, right? So they're taking away resources meant for pe- black Americans. That he's homeless. Mm-hmm. If you take his cigarettes away, man, I, <laughs> I know he smoked Newports. <laughs> that's the only thing that's keeping him together is Newport. <laughs> you gonna take his uh, you gonna take his resources and you gonna take his Newports? <laughs> man. You gonna set that dude off. Let's go to the next video. Another, it shows what's hurt black people the most. If you really want to help black folk. Yeah. Look at this. The reason people in Oakland are seriously struggling is because there's no jobs. There's no way to get money, to make money, to pay bills. Everything that come here closes down. Dunkin' Donuts came to Oakland. Dunkin' Donuts shut down. Can't make it no more. We have the Starbucks right here. Starbucks gone. Closed down. Leaving Oakland. Can't make it here no more. 
We just got this Raising Cane's restaurant over here. They had to close down the inside. Gone. Can't open no more. Almost every built business that opens up in Oakland closes. Business is closed. Everything closed. Lunch and Chipotle closed. In and out burger on the, on the other side of this used to be a Walmart. We don't even have a Walmart in Oakland. You know you ain't got no jobs if you don't got no Walmart in your city. You know your city's struggling if you don't got no Walmart. Walmart closed down. Walmart could not survive Oakland. Oakland is a hard place to survive. We got in and out Burger right there on the other side, ready to close down. And I'm pretty sure Panda going after that. Next to T-Mobile and Chipotle, the little restaurant in there closed. The little, closed. The little restaurants across the street you can't see in their parking lot closed. All these big old buildings. It's trash in the street. That's enough. Cut out. This is depressing. You know why they all these businesses are closing in these cities where it's primarily black people? Liberal policies. Liberal policies. Y'all won't even risk. Y'all don't even hold black people accountable when they steal stuff. Y'all just let them go like shoplifting is through the roof. Yeah. Why? Because you don't really enforce it because who's doing it? Here, look at this video. This who doing it. This is why everything leaves. Damn, that's loud as hell. <laughs> look at this. Look at the white people looking at them. <laughs> uh, just another day in Oakland. That is. And nobody's doing anything. Well, he's a Negro. He might have a gun. Yeah. Crazy as hell. He, can't, his, he got so many phones, he's pulling his pants down. Now he don't want to sag look his pants. His, look at his, uh, what yeah. A, um, yeah. Just sit. He don't even want to sag his pants no more. Man, that's that's low IQ right there. That's Oakland. Hey, Keith, you saw that, right? The way he stole that? Yeah. That's low IQ. Why didn't he just bring a bag? He probably smoked menthols. You're going to really set that dude off. Man, let's address the elephant in the room. Did you see that dumb Negro, how he stole them for? He can't even steal right. Well, that was effective to me. It was quick. Oh, man, his pants is pulling down his pants. Huh? You look, Keith, you walk in the store, pull out a bag, start ripping the phones, <laughs> we just walk out like <laughs> cell phones. <laughs> Big pro, they can't even be professional when he steals something. All this stuff impacting black people in black neighborhoods, and you're focusing on menthol cigarettes? Yeah. They don't, they, what, what me and my brother's trying to tell y'all, you Negroes, right? What, they, what me and my brother, the message we trying to convey, right? Sit down and listen, shut up, right? Put your damn menthols down and shut up. I'm trying to help you. What we're trying to tell you, right? What, what we're trying to tell you is. What it, say it, Kevin. Shut up. What, they trying, what we're trying to tell you is they ain't trying to help y'all. All right, they ain't trying to help y'all. What they're trying to do, they just want to give the impression that they're helping y'all for a vote. Yeah. That's what they're doing. Dumb. I can't believe you got kids like chopping tits off and chopping penises off and taking drugs to stop their puberty. Yeah. Y'all applaud that. Some areas of the country you can smoke weed, which I'm, I have nothing against. Yeah. But you're going to ban menthol cigarettes? I bet you Negroes is falling for it, too. Damn good show. Damn good show. Hey, we got new when are you giveaway Negroes going. Negroes ever going to learn? Hey, we got a new giveaway going. We give away a Ford F-250, 10000 in cash to end of the win. Go to officialhawkstwins.com. Anything you buy from the site, get you automatically. From the end of the win. <laughs> yeah. From the site. <laughs>